How should I think about my financial goals for 2019? First of all, Happy New Year. And second of all, it's really very personal. Uh, if you haven't paid down your credit card, you want to get that, that credit card debt down because that stuff is expensive. If you don't have an emergency fund, that three months or so of take home pay that's in the bank, safe, waiting there for when emergencies can happen, you want to do that. If you're not investing in a 401k at work, if it's available, you want to do that. And if you can, you want to also invest. Start small. At LFS, we have no minimum. So you can start literally with a penny. Please don't, but you could literally start with a penny. But beginning to put aside 1% of your take home pay, 2%, 3%, 4%, and really working to ratchet that up during the year. So if you do that as a habit, you know, the compounding effects of that over time, the growth potential of that over time, as the markets, if the markets perform as they have historically.